Right, time to feed the goldfish. Got some blood worms. I will soon be moving this one downstairs. There's the plaque, see it barging other fish out the way. Don't come in here, you bastard, that kind of thing. I didn't last long, did I? I'll be moving that one downstairs and also the plec. And um, do you know, I think I forgot to feed the goldfish downstairs today, which doesn't matter because it does them good every now and again to go a day without. It's good for their digestion and stuff. So I'll give them a good. Oh no, I gave them blood worms. I forgot about that. I chucked a cube of blood worms in there. Excuse the noise in the background. Assassin's Creed Mirage. But I mean, a lot of people, you know, a lot of people only keep the tropicals. They think that they're kind of snobs, you know? Uh, oh, I've got these fish, I've got these fish. But there's a lot to be said for just simple goldfish, you know? They don't cause any problems. They eat anything you put in there. They're not finicky. They're not skittish. I probably should have put that fucking volume down. But yes, there's a lot to be said for cold water fish. And they don't require a heater, which probably saves you two or three pounds a month. Over the course of a year, that's about 40 quid a year. 50, 60 dollars. So yeah, there's a lot to be said about cold water fish. I think, I think that, um, as you know, the albino Oscar downstairs has got a hole in the head. If that fish, if that, please hold. No, fuck off you bastard. Fuck you know. Notice it never buffers, does it, you know? It never, but you're sitting there watching it, buffering like a motherfucker. You're filming something, flawless internet. But yes. I think if the albino downstairs, if that condition did not respond to treatment, I think I would have a lot more cold water fish in the future. You know? Definitely. But anyway, this has been going on long enough. Thank you for watching if you did, and I'll see you in the next one.